Disaster struck at night. Into the early hours of the morning on January 14, 2012, the Costa Concordia, with more than 4,000 on board, began to capsize after it hit rocks close to Geo Island. Amid a chaotic evacuation, 32 people went down with the ship. In breach of the Sailors' Code, Captain Francesco Scatino was not one of them. Branded Captain Coward by the Italian media, the Naples-born skipper came under fire for boarding a life raft ahead of his passengers. A lapse in judgment that accounted for one of the 16-year sentence Scatino was slapped with last year. The disgraced seaman was found guilty of manslaughter and causing a maritime accident. Back in court Thursday, the 55-year-old is battling to overturn the conviction. His lawyers will argue that the sinking was a collective failure and Scatino has been unfairly made a scapegoat. We think there are some serious elements of responsibility which cannot be attributed to Scatino and we hope that we can prove it. Costa Cruises, the company that owned the ship, dodged criminal charges with a 1 million euro fine. They're being sued for damages by the Tuscany region, Geo Island and survivors. There was a glimmer of justice, but we are still a long way off. The company that is responsible for what Schettino did needs to be held responsible. Not backing down, the prosecution is seeking to up the captain's sentence to 26 years. If Schettino loses, his last stop will be Italy's highest court of appeal.